Heading, Introduction In a recent turn of events at Wolverhampton Wanderers, manager Gary O'Neill finds himself addressing a training ground incident involving star player Johnny Castro Otto. The incident has generated significant attention from various sports media outlets, shedding light on the details and consequences. Heading, the BBC report The BBC provides a comprehensive overview of the incident, offering insights into the nature of the occurrence. With a reputation for reliable sports coverage, the BBC's report forms a crucial part of the narrative, providing the initial details that sparked widespread interest. Heading, Daily Mail's perspective Turning to the Daily Mail, another prominent source in sports journalism, we delve into their take on the Wolves star's ban from the training ground. The Daily Mail's coverage may offer additional perspectives, quotes, or exclusive information, contributing to the overall understanding of the incident. Heading, Mirror's coverage and Gary O'Neill's response The Mirror, known for its in-depth sports analysis, provides a different angle on the Wolves situation. Gary O'Neill's response to the incident is highlighted, giving readers an insight into the manager's stance and the actions taken by the club in response to the incident. Heading, Express and Stars Update for a Local Perspective, the Express and Stars report on the incident provides an update from Wolves boss Gary O'Neill himself. This piece may offer exclusive details or quotes directly from those involved, giving readers a more intimate understanding of the ongoing situation at Wolverhampton Wanderers. Heading, Sport Bible's take on the Wolves controversy Finally, Sport Bible, known for its engaging football content, presents its perspective on the incident involving Wolves, Gary O'Neill, and Johnny Castro Otto. Exploring Spot Bible's coverage could reveal additional opinions, fan reactions, or unique insights into the Premier League drama. Heading, So, the Wolves training ground incident has captivated the football community, drawing attention from reputable sources such as the BBC, Daily Mail, Mirror, Express and Star, and Sport Bible. As the story unfolds, fans eagerly await further updates on the situation and the implications for Johnny Castro Otto's future with the club.